Rob. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Rob's Rogues and the BatmanUniverse.net. Um, we're going to be taking a look at Superhero Stuff's August box of the month. It is the Robin slash Nightwing box in honor of uh, Robin Dick Grayson's 75th anniversary this year. Uh, the month of August for Superhero Stuff also had a Harley Quinn box, so you get one or the other or both. Um, it was uh, seven, excuse me, fifty dollars forty nine ninety nine, uh, fifty bucks for seventy dollars worth of content. Now I'm shooting this intro out of sequence. I've already filmed the box, uh, the unboxing of it, and I still have one more segment to do some close ups of it. Um, I actually think I got more than uh, $70 worth. It says on their uh, website, uh, $50 and you get $70 worth of content. Um, I say it in the video, I believe, but in case I don't, uh, they give you a little card, like a little picture of everything that you should have in your box. And I had a second card that said, um, oops, one of your, oops, we didn't have a, uh, enough of the items that we were going to, one of the items we were going to send you. So they replaced it with something else. And I got to looking on their website. Uh, that single item is $35 by itself just for one single item. And you know, there's a t-shirt in there and, you know, some other things like that. So I won't spoil too much here. Uh, most people know what the uh, box of the month is. Um, there's loot crate and, um, a geek box and nerd block and a, a whole bunch of different ones out there. Basically, uh, you pay a set fee probably for a monthly uh, subscription, and then they send you boxes full of stuff. Um, could be you know anything. Sometimes there's themes. Uh, with superhero stuff dot com, uh, it's going to be hero based on a specific hero. Or uh, there's a Star Wars box I think you can get now. Um, a Walking Dead box, but uh, generally you'll get like a Batman, a Robin, a Nightwing, or whatever uh, that is. So uh, first time I've ever done one of these, uh, my wife actually does one for Cricket, and not the phone company, but she is a scrapbooker. So uh, Cricket is a company that does a lot of uh, scrapbooking tools, and they have what they call a mystery box. And she uh, gets them frequently. She'll, you know, maybe a one every other month or something like that. And I've never done one. And I was like, hey, they've got a, a Robin box. That would be pretty cool to get. So this is the first mystery box uh, that I've ever uh, picked up. So um, seeing the $50 price tag uh, at first was a little like, nah, I hope it's I hope it's good stuff. And I hope there's not, you know, just junk in it. And uh, I actually think I got a really, really good box. So enough talking. Let's get into the unboxing. So we've got our hero and box here, and uh, it's for Robin's 75th anniversary. So let's go ahead and see what goodies we've got. As I probably slice right through the shirt. So this is pretty cool. Uh, like they, like I said earlier, it's 50 bucks for $70 worth of content. I have seen some of these. Some are pretty cool. Some are... Uh, so so, but I'm hoping with the Robin, a Robin and Nightwing, it'll be pretty cool. So, all right, pretty cool. First thing up, <laughs> this <is> Borbs, <laughs> pretty cool. Robin thing, so pretty cool. Set on the computer, nice. Uh, what else do we got here? <laughs> I'm laughing because I'm seeing some of the stuff that's in here. Um, I'm not sure what this is. Ooh, it's a watch. A Nightwing watch. That's that's actually kind of impressive. I don't know if you can see that. I'll have better pictures of it uh, later. So, very cool. I was not expecting a Nightwing watch. Again, it's Dick Grayson's 75th anniversary. Uh, there are some <laughs> Robin... <laughs> Robin socks there, so uh, I'll look all kinds of cool. <laughs> uh, my wife's filming, so she's pointing at herself like she'll be wearing these. Um, cool Nightwing. Uh, so far, it's been a very um, Nightwing box. So there's the Nightwing shirt, which I haven't seen it myself. Oh, that's actually pretty cool. Nice, Olivia. You're gonna need one. Um, what else we got here? 
little Robin pin. A Nightwing keychain. Pretty cool. I think I could actually throw this and do some damage with it. <laughs> so that's pretty neat. Um, I was looking for this, so this is actually pretty cool. Um, I have the uh, like little animated uh, Super Friends version, but this is a Tim Drake Robin sticker for your vehicle, so that's pretty cool. Um, and do have another a Nightwing pin, and they promise a comic, and it is We Are Robin number two. I do have this one, but it'll be nice just to have a an extra one. So that's the hero box. A, we'll get a better shot of all these since I've opened them up really fast in the next segment. All right, we're looking at my nice red table here. Kind of move it around. So um, I think I got everything pretty well uh, shot in the uh, unboxing portion of it. Um, actually, my wife did the uh, filming of it. Uh, but we were under a time crunch to get my artwork um matted in time as Hobby Lobby was getting ready to close. So I just kind of wanted to show you just in a little bit better uh, what everything looked like just so you can kind of see everything nice and clear and under the uh, nice review lights that I have here. So bear with me as I set this down so I don't knock everything over. So I'm just going to kind of pull them out at random. Um, I'm going to save the best part uh, for last year's, you're hearing things uh, fall off the back. Um, I'm going to open this uh, here. Uh, here are the socks. And uh, this is probably the only one that um, I would have much rather had a hat. Um, uh, I mean, it'll be fine. I mean, I'm a guy, so... Um, actually, my wife said she would probably end up wearing these. I mean... I, I could wear them under, you know, some pants, but I don't think I'm going to be wearing, you know, shorts and being like, hey, take a look at my Robin socks. Um, <laughs> you know, I I don't know. So th not that I'm like overly disappointed, but uh, again, um, I probably would have sent something else. Um, this is probably the only thing I'm like, eh, socks. Um, so, but... There again, uh, very little on the Robin end of it. This is very much a Nightwing box, which being a Robin fan, I'm a little disappointed because it said Nightwing and Robin, but it is Nightwing's or Dick Grayson's 75th anniversary. So um, I am happy with everything that I have. I mean, yeah, these are these are cute, I guess you could say it. Uh, no R on them anywhere, which I find kind of odd but um, anyway there are the socks as we're kind of looking at the socks a little bit too much there uh, the next thing we pull out here again uh, in no particular order um, this is the only uh, one of two duplicates I have I already have this um, I bought it from um, Hot Topic and I think it was about eleven dollars so um, I still have the other one in, in its box I think I have the receipt I'm half tempted to just take one of these two back and get Batman so um, but I mean had I not it's kind of like hindsight being 2020 had I just waited a little bit I would have had this um, if I didn't have it I would obviously I like this I obviously bought it uh, for myself so um, maybe this will be a, just a, a giveaway on my channel maybe I'll just keep it for a, a giveaway when I do something so um, anyway I thought this was pretty cool um, Derbas, so I think these are neat. I haven't reviewed him yet, but uh, you know that came in the box So pretty cool. I uh, maybe we'll do the Robin content first if I can uh, get it all um, this little pin which um, Some of the stuff is filler for you know uh, price wise. I think this is like a dollar ninety nine on their website I think these might be uh, 16 15 or 16 bucks something like that. So a hat might have been close in there um, the, the, the almost falls there. Uh, this Robin decal, which is kind of hard to see, it's basically this. This Tim Drake Robin. There, you can kind of see it there. Um, my car is about on its last leg, knowing I'm going to replace it soon. So I'm probably going to wait till I get a 
a new vehicle to put this on. So um, I think it's cool. I've been looking for this to put on my car and I haven't been able to find it. So I thought, well, the next time I go to SuperheroStuff.com and uh, I'll throw this on my cart and I never got around to doing it. So I'm glad that I got it, you know, for what it is. It's, again, probably a couple bucks here. Um, let's see. The other Robin item here is this comic. This is the other duplicate that I have. Um, started with the, uh, it's We Are Robin issue two. Uh, this is where, um, I know they, uh, on the little card that you get that tells you everything that you have here, um, says it's hand selected uh, by you as the shirt is. So, um, uh, first of all, the Nightwing shirt, I got a really good shot of it during the unboxing, so I didn't bring it up here. Um, I guess if you really wanted to see the shirt again, uh, then wait till I do another live <laughs> show, and I'll probably be wearing it. Uh, but getting back to the comic and kind of tying in with the shirt, uh, they probably just have different stuff like, okay, here's this type of shirt we're going to grab. So it's probably at random depending on whoever's picking it up. Uh, there is the Robin Son of Batman series. I probably would have gone with that. Uh, they could have gone with Grayson. They could have gone with Teen Titans with Red Robin in it. Uh, they could have really gone on a stretch and put Batman Beyond. Uh, Weird Robin is cool. I'm I'm kind of starting to get interested into this uh, series, which I will be reviewing here before too long. Um, I, if they were going to do Robin, I wish they would have done a proper Robin comic. Not that this isn't. It's Robin at heart. I'm probably nitpicking a little bit. Um, it's cool that we get. you always get a comic with these. Um, it, it, it could have been anything. So uh, I'll add it to my collection, like I said in the video. Now I've got, you know, two. Maybe it could be another giveaway on the channel or something like that. But still, if I hadn't had it, well, then um, cool. So, um Let's see. Uh, this I think is really pretty cool. Uh, this keychain here, this Nightwing keychain, which is kind of funny. It's got the new 52 Nightwing here, and it's got the animated series. This is actually really uh, pretty uh, decent. I'll pull Stu's trick here and show you the uh, pop can uh, just in you know size. So putting this on your key ring, that's going to take up some uh, space in your um, in your pocket or your purse or you know wallet or billfold. Um, let me put it up with my uh, drum set or something like that, or maybe on my keys. I thought this was pretty cool. Um, there isn't a Robin uh, key ring on uh, SuperheroStuff.com, so um, I thought this was nice. And it's, uh, it's a decent uh, weight, too. It's a nice uh, uh, metal piece, so it's not like chintzy plastic or something like that. So this is actually pretty decent. Uh, there is a Nightwing button here, if I don't lose him in the box. Um, so there is the Nightwing button. Uh, very much the animated series a little bit. This is uh, definitely uh, Batman the Animated Series. This is more um, Arkham City-ish a little bit and probably more um, Young Justice cartoon series. So still, uh, you know, a little pin for, you know, whatever. Uh, the T-shirt, the Nightwing T-shirt that you saw, if you just, you know, we obviously saw the unboxing and my reaction to everything. Um, now, here's everything that uh, the, this comes with. There's the Robin button, the socks, uh, the uh, T-shirt, which we've already seen, the button, the decal, the keychain, uh, the comic book, which is a mystery, the shirt is a mystery. Uh, the only other thing is the glass. So I was supposed to have gotten the Nightwing glass, and apparently they are out. And these glasses run anywhere from... Uh, $19 probably at the max. Uh, some comic book shops are selling them for $21, maybe $22. Um, my wife said she's uh, seen some at other places for about $15. So about $15 to $22. What they substituted, and we've already seen it in the video, uh, was uh, this Nightwing watch, which is really, really nice. Um, it retails for $35. So if the glass was $20 at the max, uh, I probably got an extra 10 close to $15 worth. So my hero box, which you pay $50, you get $70 worth of um, goodies. This is actually probably 75 closer to 80 just because of this watch. Um, my wife said, you know, she's bought, uh, bought me a Batman watch similar to this. 
uh, for about 22, but uh, there is a retail price of 35, like 34.98 on superherostuff.com. Which, if you were going to buy it, that's what they're going to charge you uh, for this. So this was the highlight for me. Um, yes, I was really hoping for uh, a little bit more Robin content because I'm a Robin fan. But with what I have, um, I'm actually really impressed, and this makes me go. I might do another one of these. And the watch is what it really sold on me. It's a it's a nice watch. I haven't got it out yet. I got to set my time. It says it's what you know five o'clock here, which it's not. It's uh, actually nine. Uh, but um, this really impressed me. I thought, okay, if I was going to get the glass according to their checklist here, it would have probably been something a little chintzy or a right around a dollar value. And that they went ahead and did the watch um, it really kind of impressed me. So um, I just wanted you to be able to see everything. I like that it has, you know, it's in blue here. It's kind of like an iridescent, which it kind of blends in with the face of the watch under the right light. So, um, when you get it turned just right, the Nightwing symbol comes through. So, uh, very cool. Uh, this kind of made the box for me. So, um, if you've been kind of on the fence about the superhero box, um, give it a shot. Um, it's kind of one of those, sometimes you not entirely sure what you're going to get out of the box. Um, I've seen some people be disappointed in them. I don't know if we're expecting, you know, action figures and, all these different type of things. I know some people have received action figures in them, but uh, I guess it just depends on the character, excuse me, the characters that got the hiccups. So I wanted you to be able to see this and uh, just a little bit closer, even though we've already done the unboxing. Hopefully under these lights, you can get a little bit better look.